Thank you all for attending this mandatory team building session. This year, instead of trust falls, we're making you all do the purge. What? Well, don't just stand there, go purge. Doesn't that look like fun? <laughs> yeah, okay, but so, all crime is legal. Ah, uh, yes. Well, you can't harm any high-level government employee, but that probably won't affect you. Isn't there something illegal that you always wanted to do? Well, I guess I've always wanted to steal a car. Great, great, well, go do that then. But then tomorrow do I have to go to the DMV to get it registered? Oh, shit, that's a good question. Yes, I guess technically you would have to register it. Mm -hmm. uh, what about proof of insurance? Yeah, do that too, but the theft is legal. Do I have to prove I stole it during the perg, or will they just assume? Like, what if I stole a car yesterday? Hypothetically. Just go kill someone. Oh, thank you for bringing up murder. Now, hypothetically, if I wanted to kill Grant, right, and I stab him, stab him, just before the purge ends, but he doesn't die until after the purge is over, does that count? Is that okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's fine. What if it's a gun? What if I fire it, like, right as it ends, the bullet- You're all overthinking this. Let's just deal with these situations if and when they come up, huh? So I have a question. Cocaine, is that legal? Yes, yes, cocaine is legal. Oh, cool, so I won't get addicted. Oh, oh that's, that's really good. Right. Actually, that's not how drugs work. Oh, I've got one. Uh, you know what, this isn't a freshman ethics class. It's the fucking purge. <laughs> if the purg only happens in America, does that include territories like Guam and Puerto Rico? Yeah, uh, what's up with that? I don't know, sure. Follow up, uh, Guam is over the international date line. Right, so does that mean they had a purg yesterday? It's pronounced purge! What am I saying? Ooh, what about Canada? That's basically America. No, no it's not. I'm bad at geography, you know, it's this shoddy American education system. Or should I say, Canadian education system. No. But I can still purge though, right? Even though I'm not an American citizen? Weirdly, yes. Oh, I, I have, have a question. question. <laughs> oh, no, you, you can go. No, you go ahead. Oh, no. Okay, what, what if? if <laughs> okay, this time I'm not gonna say You go ahead. No. You go, please. Um, what if... Okay, I guess I'll go. Are the unforgivable curses from Harry Potter okay? Can I own a ferret? They're usually illegal in California. And if I marry multiple people during the purge, do I get to stay married after? I just love love. Aww. Okay, everyone, just do whatever you want for the next 12 hours, and don't worry about the legal minutia. Ooh, what's going on at the International Space Station? Ugh. Oh. God. Because that's partly owned by the U.S., so does that mean just part of it is purging? Well, it's actually called purging. Astronauts are high-level government employees. Do you ever think of that, you fucking moron? So the purge isn't happening on the space station. You know, I could have been an astronaut if it weren't for my shoddy Canadian education. Canada is not part of America, all right? What is wrong with you people? Act on any dark impulse in your little twisted hearts, okay? Kill each other for all I care. Go purge! Okay. No, those are trademarked. You can't use those. Oh, I'm sorry. I just like that. And that's why we were awesome. Hi, I'm Siobhan from College Humor. Click over here to subscribe and click here for more fun stuff. You filthy animals. I was abandoned in this office when I was 10 years old by my parents. I've only eaten pizza for such a long time. I think I have scurvy.